Good afternoon, everyone, and happy Earth Day. I hope that you're having such a great day today. Uh, I will be sending some Earth Day activities that you can do at home. I'll be sending those in the letter uh, a little bit later today. Uh, but for now, we're going to do a little bit more addition and subtraction practice using fruits. So yesterday, you were coloring and cutting out and creating different fruit crafts. Uh, and today we're going to use those fruits to help us with some addition and subtraction. Let's just remind ourselves what addition and subtraction are. So can you say addition? Very good. So this is the symbol for addition. And when you add things together, you're going to have more of them. And can you say subtraction? It's a big word. Awesome. So this is the symbol for subtraction. And when you subtract things from each other, you're going to have fewer of them, okay? So let's try some addition and subtraction practice using some fruit. So these are supposed to be some strawberries. Uh, so let's count how many strawberries we have. One, two, three. So we have three strawberries plus, meaning we're adding, two strawberries. One, two. How many strawberries do we have? Hmm. Let's count them. One, two, three, plus one, two is four, and five. Very good. Five strawberries. Excellent. All right, let's try a little subtraction. These are not carrots. They are pineapples. Let's count how many pineapples we have. One, two, three, four, five. Five pineapples, and we are subtracting, meaning we're taking away just one pineapple. So if we have five pineapples and we take away one, how many are we left with? Very good, four pineapples. One, two, three, four. Excellent job. All right, let's do another subtraction. These are blueberries, of course. Let's count how many blueberries we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine blueberries. That is a lot of blueberries. And we're going to subtract how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that was Sergeant Pepper running by. So if we have nine blueberries and we're subtracting or getting rid of eight, how many are we going to have left? What do you think? Very good, just one blueberry left. Very good job, all right? I'm gonna send another video in just a minute. Uh, with some a couple more practice problems. All right, see you in just a sec.